Yes, my dear friend, welcome back to the channel. This is your channel, Salon's Blog. I'm welcoming a very special way because it is the weekend. It is a match day, of course, Saturday morning here in Southeast Asia. Wherever you are, you are highly welcome. Well, we are going straight into, the, into business. And what is a business that we are starting with? We are starting with Nkuku and Romeo Lavia. Nkuku and Romeo Lavia. What is happening, my dear friend? Hey, if today is your first time of watching this video, kindly like the video. Share it and let me hear from you in the comment section. And don't forget the most important thing. Subscribe. Sign, subscribe to the channel. Click on that subscription button and on your notification bell so that in case of any exclusives, you'll be first to be notified. Yeah. And if you have been here with me all this while, my dear friend, remember today is a match day and it's all about Bet Winner. Click on the link at the description there. Register with Bet Winner. And use my promo code to bet. My promo code is TIM1979. T-I-M-1979. And bet with bet winner this weekend on any of the games. Trust me, you're going to win something great. Yeah, you surely win. For, you know, for a weekend celebration and Christmas ahead. Bet winner is all the, it's the way forward. Bet with them and you win great. With my promo code, TIM1979. T-I-M-1979. Let's get started, my dear friend. We are today starting with Nkuku and Romeo Lavia. Our coach has been speaking, and he made a point. He was asked specifically questions regarding Romeo Lavia and Nkuku. Pochettino on Nkuku and Lavia's chances of facing Brighton. What did the coach have to say? Let's get on. When the coach was asked this question, the head coach answered the media's question at Cobham. After a freezing morning, Freezing morning training session in which Nkuku had joined with the start of the team training. But Lavia was absent. Lavia was absent in training. It was very early morning training. Normally, 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 most of the time it's afternoon training. But this time around, it is morning training, dear friend. And when the coach was asked, this is what he has to say. He said, with 48 hours still to go until the girls' visit, Pochettino couldn't provide absolute confirmation about this and others' availability with a decision to be made on Saturday, which is today. Look, I can tell you that we are about 90% into uh, in Kuku this weekend. Tomorrow, uh, Saturday, Sunday's game, 90% in Kuku will be playing tomorrow's game. Maybe he might not be in a starting level, but you know, like last weekend, I said it, something came up and it didn't, it didn't happen. In tomorrow's game, if Nkuku doesn't start, you, have, you will see him in the second half. Unless, unless, of course, something else happened. Listen to what he said. He said, I don't believe we can recover some players that we may thought was possible, said Pochettino. He doesn't believe that we, they can recover some of the players that were thought to be possible. Because some of the players, honestly speaking, no matter what they do, they cannot play. Let us not forget our defense. Rhys James is absent. Um, 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 how do you call him? Rhys James will be absent. And who else again? Who received the, 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 the red card? Malo, is it, no, no, Malo Gusto. Oh, my, my goodness. I'll, 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 I'll come back to that. Some players that were that are already on the card. Kukurela, Ma Kukurela. Kukurela is also absent. Reserve is absent. Kukurela is also absent. Is Badeshelli ready to hold that defense? The Sassi alone can he do the job with Thiago Silva? Is Levi Cowell ready? Ben Chiwa is also absent through injury. As a matter of fact, why it is more dicey, why I suspect that Nkuku will be playing, let me get, go straight to it, which I want to make a specific video on that, new episode on that, Kasaido. Emotional Kasaido. That is a different thing altogether that we'll be going into. But over the week, we saw Romeo Lavia train. We saw Nkuku train throughout. Yesterday, training, that early morning training, Lavia was not part of it. 
Lavi was not in training early morning. I don't know whether the second session he came or not, but the coach was in a press conference in the afternoon. After the press conference, the, next, the second session that they had, you know, this week they've been having double sessions. This week has all been double session training. Are we going to see Nkuku and Romeo Lavia on Sunday? Very possible. Especially Nkuku. Very, very possible. Today, Saturday, we will see what will happen next within the camp. Nkuku, Romeo Lavia. I am of the view that it's time. He said there is still one training session more and we will see what is going on tomorrow. There's still one training session that yesterday evening. And then they will see what will happen today, which is Saturday. Do you get it? What's going on tomorrow? And see, some, some players can be available. And see if some of the players can be available. We need, we need to assess Lavia and Kuku tomorrow. And then decide. They are close, but we need to take the decision. Maybe we need to take the decision. He said, maybe Lavia is the more difficult one. Maybe Lavia is the more. Read, if you know, when you are reading a statement from someone, you need to read in between the lines. Now, he was specific here. He said, we need to assess Lavia and Nkuku tomorrow, which is today, Saturday, and then decide. They are closed, but we need tomorrow to take the decision, which is today, Saturday, to make the decision. All right, then he now ended. He said, maybe Lavia is the more difficult one. It means that the possibility of both, even playing, is clear. But maybe, maybe Lavia might be the difficult one to handle, which means that Nkuku is already passed. Nkuku is already Past. Green light. <laughs> yes! Yes! Yes, dear friend. Watch out for Nkuku in Sunday's game. Watch out. I'm telling you, watch out for Nkuku on Sunday's game. It is very possible. It is possible. And I am here to tell you that I am 90%, in fact, not 100%, because anything can still happen. It is football. But I am 90% sure that Nkuku might be in the game tomorrow. The game against Brighton is a game we are to win, hands down. Anything, a, a, a loss, to, if we are to lose that match tomorrow, Pochettino will say we're in trouble. If Chelsea lose the game tomorrow against Brighton, the coach himself will be in a very big trouble. I am not saying he'll be sacked tomorrow, no. But he'll be laying the foundation for his sack, for his dismissal. He'll be laying the foundation for that. What about that happens tomorrow? If it's not a win, anything less than a win for Pochettino tomorrow at Stamford Bridge, he'll be laying his own foundation for the next season. Dear friend, I just came to announce to you that 90% surety is there for Nkuku. We might see Nkuku in tomorrow's game. I'll see you in the next one when you see me. Shalom and peace.